Welcome to Devices Setup and today we will learn how to resolve IE key camera not connecting to the Wi-Fi. So some of these fixes has worked for many of the clients and might work for you too. So let's get started. First and foremost, the most basic and important one is to reboot your devices. So unplug your modem, your router and your camera from power for around 60 seconds and then plug them back in. Secondly, try placing the camera closer to the Wi-Fi router at location where you get strong Wi-Fi signals. If Wi-Fi connectivity is an issue, then we recommend you to either set up a Wi-Fi extender which will extend your Wi-Fi or you can also get mesh Wi-Fi system which will make sure you have strong Wi-Fi throughout your house. Next, make sure your router or any additional firewall or Mac filtering is not blocking the camera. After this, make sure you have updated your Cloud Edge app and your camera has latest firmware. Watch video given in the description to learn how to update it. Next, make sure you have granted location access, Bluetooth access, and other permissions to the app. After this, log in into your router and try changing the security type from WPA to WPA2 or WPA3. And if you don't know how to log in into your router, then video is given in the description. Make sure your Wi-Fi password doesn't have any special characters, as sometimes the Cloud Edge app might not be able to recognize those special characters. So we recommend you to customize the password to something simple. Watch video given in the description to learn how to change Wi-Fi password. Moreover, if your network Wi-Fi SSID have any special character or extra spaces, then also try changing the SSID to something simple. Moreover, once logged in into your router's web management page, you can also try changing your router's 2.4 GHz channel to 1, 6, 9 or 11 and then try the setup again. On the top of that, make sure your phone and your camera both are connected to the 2.4 GHz router's network. Plus, make sure you have not turned on VPN on your cell phone on which you are using this app. If it's active, then turn it off. Lastly, we recommend you to reset your camera and set it up again. And if you found this video helpful, then please do hit like and subscribe to support my efforts. Thank you.